Oh, by the way, Sandy, it's pronounced Sandy, not Senry, right? Mm, <laughs> yeah, it's a difficult question. Uh, Pronunciation in Canada yeah. is Sandy. 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 <laughs> Sandy. <laughs> Am I Sandri is correct, maybe. Yeah. But, mm. Well, that's how the English say it. They say Sandri with the R. Yeah. yeah. But, but I've, I've heard you say Sandy, I think. Because so. Japanese pronunciation is Sandy. Right. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Not Sandri. So but in, yeah, yeah. English, but English speaking. English, not, yeah. But Sandri is okay. R I. Right, right. Yeah. Mm. Not, not right. too many R's in uh, mm -hmm. Japan. Right, mm. right. The, right. 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 Enjoy. You feel okay?
Um, all right, we're going to give Sammy just a quick breather. Yeah. Although she yeah. probably doesn't need it, she could probably play all night. Um, <laughs> but we'll do, uh, you know, we do want to try to, you know, get some questions in if anyone has, you know, questions. Uh, I'm going to explain the kit very briefly. This is not a gear pitch, just to let you guys know what she's, you know, what she's playing on. Uh, this is the Phoenix kit. This is what she plays, this exact same configuration at home, uh, in the studio all the time. Uh, this particular one is 8.7, 10.8, 12.7 rack toms, uh, 14 by 13, 16 by 15 floor toms. Uh, the kick drum, uh, 22 by 16. Uh, her snare of choice that she always plays is 14 by 6, absolute hybrid maple. Um, her drum head's always on top, uh, the Evans 2-ply black chrome. And if you guys have, you know, after, after, you know, please, you know, take, come take a look and, and check it out. Um, the Evans ST, ST, super tough, super tough. Uh, is, her, is her snare head. And uh, the side snare, this one is a 14 by 5 and a half uh, stainless steel recording custom that she uses the calf tone, Evans calf tone head on. And obviously all Zildjian cymbals, she uses a lot of um, Constantinople crashes, um, a K-Ride, 13 inch K-Hats. And uh, bass drum head is Evans EMAD uh, Heavy. Uh, what do they call it? Heavy? EMAD Heavyweight? Heavyweight. Yeah. Heavyweight, yes. Um, so yeah, this is, what she, this is what she plays, you know, all the time at home. This particular kit is not hers. This particular kit is Morant's. So uh, talk to Morant about that, you know, afterwards if you like. But <laughs> did, uh, There's of the gear sold. Um, did, we'll did you guys have any, any, any questions? Yes? Uh, what does absolute hybrid maple mean? Uh, it's just the particular shell on that one is, uh, it's a maple shell. Uh, what we term hybrid is the very middle ply is in, this, in that particular shell, um, Wenge. So it's, it's, a, it's a hybrid of materials used in, in the shell. So and that really hard, dense, dry wood in the middle ply, um, it, it just it lowers, the, lowers the pitch of the, of the shell, yeah. So it's a hybrid shell. Uh, this isn't jazz re um, drum related, but are uh, Kyo Sen or um, the Jazz Avengers ever planning to come to North America? Nah, no. No. <laughs> no. Is that one of one of your bands? Yeah. Two, yes. two, two bands. Two bands. Kyo Sen. The Kyo Sen and jazz Avengers. Stay in Japan. Stay in Japan. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I tried to. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's bring them over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ronnie Scotts or something. <laughs> Um, yeah. Have you ever used uh, quicker, like, kind of things for your cymbal holders? Ah, a, quick, a quicker thing. <laughs> like a, <laughs> yeah, like a, a lock nut or a quick, ah. quick release? Yeah. Sometimes? Sometimes. Do you yeah. lose wing nuts often? <laughs> it just happens <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's a, it's a good question. I, yeah, I cannot say in front of Yamaha. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's all the time. All the time. Yeah. <laughs> There's a, there's a reason why I'm standing over here. Yeah. <laughs> Something's gonna pop off. <laughs> she's a very she's a very very hard hitter. That's, 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 that's what I was gonna say. I mean, I've been watching you for yeah, a while. And she tightened him again when she just finished. Yeah. I've been watching for a while, and I have to ask, like, for such a small lady, you make such big sound. <laughs> I'm curious to know uh, what are you doing with your technique to create. Such thunderous uh, hands. My hands? Uh, yeah, uh, it's so it, sorry, important for me to make purple sound. Powerful. Uh, the sticks, the most important thing. And this is my own model from Zirjin. Signature. Signature. Uh, yeah. Model. yeah, so in Japan. Yeah, in Japan, but. Maybe you can buy on my online store. Yeah, yeah. Maybe I, I forgot. We got to talk to Zildjian to get some of these signature sticks to Canada. Yeah. But are you doing something specific to your grip yeah. to accommodate um, the, the rubber grip? Rubber yeah, grip? rubber grip. Yeah. Rubber yeah. grip, heavier. Um, centering. Not too heavy. Your fancy one. Sure. The one, the one thing we talked about in our in our thing last night is she she holds it right at the very end yeah. of the stick. Yeah. Right really, back? it's quite far back, which is why she she likes the grip. So you know, it's all it's almost you know like she's not really doing anything different. She she did molar a lot of molar studies, so you know her her wrists are, are amazing, but 
she gets a lot of whip from holding it so far back. That's why, I mean, that's just for one thing for, wow, for the hands. That far back, yeah. Yeah, and that's why she has the coating on the stick, is because she's so far back on the stick that she needs, and there's so much coming with behind it. If, like, I'll, I'll be honest, you guys got a great view over there, but the guy who's got the best view are these two guys right here. Because you, if you see the amount of power that she has in the last four inches yeah, yeah. before the stick connects. It's like it gets here and then there's a whip that comes down. Now, the other question I had was for her bass drum feet. Yes. Oh, yeah. how, far, <laughs> how far back are you on the pedal for the most part? Ah, yeah. yeah. no, where your, where your foot, where your foot is. You just leave there. Um, you grab another one. Murat, do you have a stool I can borrow? Just does it She's playing half play back, and she's, when she's doing triplets, she's moving forward yeah, simultaneously. Right. Oh, so she's moving as but a lot uh, of sort of. She'll show you. to show you when she sits down. In you know, when she's sitting, her, her exactly legs are not. not they're not <laughs> ninety degrees. You know, a lot. A lot of us, you know, grow up in taught you know, posture of ninety degrees. So she's angled. She's angled quite a bit down, when she's driving her foot forward. Uh, so she's high to, to have her legs Here. angled down and her foot's kind of coming down like that. Yeah. She, yeah, so a lot of drummers have a 90 when they're sitting. Yeah. It's quite common, right? You're on top of the pedal. Sinri has, does not run it like that. She sits further back and it allows her to do almost a kicking motion into the bass drum. She says she, 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 says she like kicks and drives she down. This is why we're here. It's because the, <laughs> like, the, like her bass drum hasn't budged an inch mm, since no. she like she's like she, but it's like it's a, it's downward. Yeah, it's downward. Yeah. yeah. I got good carpets. And yeah. good carpets. <laughs> I, first thing I said when we got here, I said to Murat, I said, "Do you like your carpet?" Uh, I said, "Do you want to put another carpet below the drum kit?" He's like, "No, no, it's good." It's but the spikes are down. Um, it's it's a really amazing technique. Like that. Kind of like the slide technique, but, so but yes. yes. Even, even though she's so far back, I noticed like when one watching, you're not having to lean no. forward much when you're drumming because like, maybe it's because of the sticks being long. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, her posture remains the same. Her feet come out and on both. It's uh, I don't even know how she stays on the stool. <laughs> Sometimes I think I might have to tape her down, but she's been good so far. So. Arigato. Arigato. Yeah. It works. Yeah. It works. Um, we play more? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We have more questions. We'll do a lot of questions there, yeah. after, okay? But thank you. Those are good, those are good, those are good questions. Yeah. Uh, she checked a bunch right now. Uh, it is funny because, you know, we do drum, I've done some drum festivals, we've done, and this is normal for her. Like, it's, uh, and we play, like, she plays with, a, you know, big men that are playing a hit. They're not as hard as her. It's just, like, she's got amazing technique. It's awesome. Yeah. Okay.
Uh, did any, before she does even more playing, did you guys want to do another question? Does anybody have any anything they want to ask? Yeah. Yes, please. Do you have like a saying schedule you find effective? Like how you go about it? Oh. A practice schedule. Yeah. Yeah, uh, when when you're at home, mm. how much time or much schedule time? schedule of practice? Yeah, like yeah. do you like? I mean, like, do you like have like set like rudiments and then like ah. do this and that? Practice changes. Recently, I often pray, Gadmin. <laughs> oh, Gadmin. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And you, you you practice the the book. Book. Yes. And uh, before the Gadmin. I do, I did, uh, Annika Nils. Uh, Annika Nils, Nils. 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 Yeah. 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 Rudiment book, do you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very. And how much, how much, how much time? Uh, oh, Gadiment and Annika uh, every day? Gadiment like that. Okay. And this. And uh, Annika's one is. More? More, oh, oh. more yeah, volume. Yeah. So, yeah, it took one year, a year or war. Okay. Two years. Yeah. Okay. Mm, it's so, it was so difficult. The uh, Annika book? Yeah. 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 Did you try that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've, I've looked at her book. I haven't really, uh, I think mainly what I use right now is, uh, oh man, what's it called? <laughs> Where's Davy Day? He knows. <laughs> George Stone? Yeah, what's the book called? George Stone book? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Thank you. Stick control? Yeah, stick control. Stick control, yeah. 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 Who's your... There's a lot of favorites. Yeah. So who is... Uh, no. No, uh... No, or... Well, who is... Who do you, you had the question the other night. Yeah. Who is your first, mo first. most most favorite? First, my first idol is Ian Pace. From Chris Powell. Nice. And you said Ian Pace and Ian Pace and Cozy Powell and uh, and also I like Chad Smith. Yeah. Yeah. She likes a lot of rock drummers. Yeah. 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 It shows from the double bass. Yeah. 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 And uh, any uh, current or now? Now. Now, who's some favorite? I like to listen to uh, Marco Miniman. Yeah, Marco Miniman. I often listen. Thomas Lang. Thomas Lang, yeah. Uh, so we we saw yeah, we saw Thomas was at the game. Quebec City right, right, thing, right, right, yeah. and uh, yeah. he was unbelievable. Yeah, of course. Yeah, he was yeah. so crazy. Anna Canals. Anna Canals is pretty good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I like her crazy. Yeah. I I've never. Seen her, so. I saw her. Uh, oh, really? have, have you seen Ronald Bruner Jr.? Ronald Bruner Jr.? Uh, Ronald Bruner. Not so. No. Not so. Oh, he's amazing too. Oh, really? Fusion, fusion drummer. Fusion drummer. Mm -hmm. Benny Grip? Benny Grip. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis Chambers? Dennis Chambers, yeah. He's okay. also my idol. Yeah. <laughs> Dennis Chambers. Mm -hmm. Anybody else? Any? Anything? Did we get get right back to it? Yeah. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> there's, a, there's a guy named Rob Brown. He's pretty good too. There's yeah. a very yeah. good guy named Rob, Rob Brown. Rob Brown's pretty good too. He okay. still so yeah. has to be in the house. He's in the house.
For a couple more questions, uh, we have got some. Uh, we've got some raffle prizes. Uh, we've got a beautiful Zildjian symbol, courtesy of uh, the good folks at Coast. Uh, we're going to give away an FP9 Yamaha pedal. I think everyone's going home with something as Marat said. Oh yeah, definitely. But uh, yes. So uh, Sammy has a very long flight, as you can probably imagine, tomorrow morning. Uh, she's rushing back home to, if you can believe it, uh, a performance on Friday. Where she's lead, leading a 15-piece big band nice. in Osaka. <laughs> in Osaka. <laughs> so uh, we asked if she like, what, like, are you are you playing right when you get home? Do you have a, a fusion gig? She said no. 15-piece uh, big band. It's like, <laughs> uh, any any final questions for for Sam? We are we are going to do some some autographs and stuff like that after the raffle. But if anyone has a question or two, anybody? Yes, sir. Do you hit, you, you play DTX too, right? Yeah. Do you hit them as hard as you hit these? Uh, do you play as hard? Do you play as hard no. on DTX? No. You, you, <laughs> you, you, you kill them. Yeah. Uh, I often change my stakes for situation. Oh, okay. For some situation in this one. Oh, for DTX? Oh, okay. For DTX and jazz sessions. It's uh, some thinner? Some kind of uh, piano trio. Oh, okay. Like and this is a, a lighter stick? This is... That's the Ringo stick? No. 7A uh, dip from Fusion. Oh, so, yeah. so, so what she's playing on now is probably like like a, an extended 5A. Right. So I guess for, for jazz and... So this is for making... Sound the sound sure. powerful. Yes. And this is for uh, more subdued, yeah. softer, articulation. I can control for this stick uh, from zero to eight. This one. Okay. And then this stick for two from two to <laughs> two ten. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Which is everybody else's 25. So. <laughs> <laughs> the power you generate is incredible. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. the yellow six five eight. Six yeah, it's five similar eight? to five eight. Okay. It's, it's but, close, but, uh, but a little longer. <laughs> yeah. Yamaha's going to design <laughs> new pedals. You yeah, we went bigger right. last time. Now we've got to go smaller. Yeah. Yeah. Short boards. Short boards. Yeah. Yeah. Ultra yeah. short. Yeah. yeah. So the big the big band music is that swing. Yeah, including swing. Including swing? The, the jet. Same, same drum set? No. No. Uh, Bigger. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Jazz Avengers, right? No. No. Uh, the big band with Eric Miyashiro, oh. uh, the trumpet uh, who plays with Buddy Rich. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. Mm. Mm. The, like four piece kit, small, small yeah, kit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 10, 12. 16. Okay. And 22? No, 20. 20. 20, 20 bass drum. Uh, new recording for sound. Okay. Tough Rima. Nice. Okay. Buddy Rich played my high school. Really? <laughs> Montreal, back in 75, 76. Wow. Did he cool. yell at anybody in the crowd? <laughs> <laughs> no, the whole band. The whole band. Our, our, our music teacher was like well connected. Uh -huh. Sammy, do you want to do uh, ah, yes, yes. selfie for the uh, for the crowd? Kind of like Marat. Oh. Just like from Montreal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I saw that one on Instagram. So, wow. Well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, do you want me to? Uh, uh, do you want me to do it? <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. All right, so we'll be back in just a couple minutes, and then Marat's going to uh, get some prizes going. Yep. Watching Sandy Kawaguchi talk to her a few times. She was very pleasant. It was a really great set. 